service bulletin is required to add a insulating cap to protect against internal arcing. Showing here quarter turn fasteners on the front panel of the PDP. You can see that the four red lights are off indicating there is no power. The panel opens up and we are looking at the offending area. This is the top of a grounded stud and pointing now to the circuit breaker that comes in contact when the panel is bent as shown here. Sometimes maintenance will over bend the panel and you will get touching of the powered circuit breaker to the standoff as shown here and it causes arcing. Some maintenance actions are required to be performed with the panel uh, supplied with power. And this is, uh, this is where the trouble, trouble occurs. So what we're looking at now, there is the offending circuit breaker uh, that would have power. And this is what we need to protect against touching to the standoff. These are the materials called out in Service Bulletin-24-161. We have a primer, we have a nut lock, we have a nylon cap, we have a self-adhesive uh, mod label, Phillips screwdriver, and paintbrush. Those are all the materials and tools that are required. First, we apply the primer, uh, part number shown here, has to be applied to both the external threads of the circuit breaker screw as well as the internal threads to the plastic nut. We let that dry for five minutes. Next, we're applying the thread locking compound. Again, we go to the same uh, screw on the circuit breaker, and then we move to the nut cap as shown here. Just do a full coating of the internal threads on the insulating nylon nut cap. Very simple. Next, we take the nut cap and thread it on the offending screw and circuit breaker. This is quite easy to do. Uh, simply, there's no torque requirements. You just go until the nut will stop and it's completely secured. Here we're showing what it looks like post-installed. Once all is complete, we add the self-adhesive label, the part number shown here. You can put it in any spot, but we typically put it in a spot that's visible. You mark the service bulletin number and the date then we peel off the uh, backing and place it on the side of the power distribution panel. This identifies that this panel has the insulating cap installed for additional protection. Thanks for watching.